What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys have been enjoying my videos lately. I know I have been, haven't been uploading as much as I should be, but I should be getting on that soon, three to four uploads a week. Also, I will be changing up my content. So it won't be just stuff I found on the App Store or uh, sus websites I find as well. I'm gonna be changing that to more iPhone tutorials for help to fix stuff and stuff like that. So step number one, to fix your iPhone home button. So one big thing which is everywhere is to calibrate your home button. So if you guys don't know how to do that, I'm gonna be showing you right now. So step number one, to calibrate your iPhone. You have to choose one of these icons, any of them, as long as they are part of your original iPhone. So I'm gonna to go to, let's just go to App Store. So I tapped App Store, and now that I'm in the App Store, all I'm gonna do is hold the home button. As you guys can see, hold the home button. Because you have to be inside the app to do this. As you see, it says slide to power off. Once you, once you see that, hold the home button until it, like, it looks like it crashes. So just hold it. Just the home button, nothing else. So as you guys see, when you guys see it, it crashed. So it kind of exits out and it does recalibrate the, the home button. So if that did not fix it, or if it actually did fix it, you guys can go ahead and click off this video, like, leave a like, and subscribe. And if that didn't fix it, we have step number two for you. Make sure you guys clean it up. Please try not to use uh, water because you guys can get damaged. But uh, a little bit of rubbing alcohol shouldn't be too bad. As long as you don't pour it on there, you should be good. Just a little bit like on a Q-tip. Start going around that. If that doesn't work, try step three, which is going to be the false home button, which I like to call it. So we're going to go ahead and switch to the cam, which you guys will see here. All right, guys. So head into settings. And then once you are guys during the settings, go to head into general. Then once in general, go into accessibility. Scroll down to you see assistive touch. Turn that on. And as soon as you turn that on, wait for a little icon up here, and there's your gestures. So you guys have tons of stuff like custom Siri, home button, cool stuff like that. You can also turn on the, the mute button just in case that breaks as well. Tons of other cool stuff, guys. This is it for my how to fix your uh, home button tutorial. Thank you guys for watching this quick video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned, stay subscribed. See you guys in the next one with more better HD quality content. Peace.